Hi, this is Ron McChew. We're playing Fishing Planet, and today we're on Emerald Lake after Trophy Perch. The peg we're fishing from is on the right, called Midland Charm. It's about 9 in the morning. We're going to be live baiting with minnows. Right, so we'll look at my tackle setup. So we're using a float, a 1 0 hook, minnows, which you have to buy from the bait store, and they're three gold for ten and the line is six pound and just a standard float rod right let's go fish so here we are nice and sunny willow tree on my right bulrushes on my left where should we go I'll choose these lily pads this is often a very good area for live baiting with the little minnows a lot of pike mainly though, so it can be a nuisance if you're trying to get the trophy perch. But you're fishing quite close in. I'm only like 16 out, just right on the edge of the lily pads. My reel speed is set to 3, and my clutch drag setting is also 3. You won't get broke or snapped on that setting. Not on here, where we're fishing, it's only mainly small pike, and the trophy perch won't give that much of a stress to your setup. You do get bites here very quickly. Normally with a minnow they are very good. Lots of fun. For the last two days I've been fishing here just uh, seeing what's what. I've got a fish biting at the minute. Here we go. Here's the first one. And it is <laughs> a little pike. We will probably get plagued by a lot of those before we get a perch. But I've been doing my awards and achievements for the pike, so that's how I found this location for the perch. There's a few little locations like near the willow tree, uh, the bulrushes on this side, lily pads, and there's also some bulrushes on the left where you get the perch. Me and Stig has been fishing, trying different baits in different areas, some that shouldn't work, some that should work, and just seeing what actually does work. We found a few nice little spots and good places for catching fish. I did used to really like fishing for big perch. I'd mainly use in real life lures. There's another little pike. Uh, lobworms. Sometimes feed a red maggot as well. So good for getting their perch. They're predatory fish as well so Small uh, live baits work well. That's what we're using now. Small minnows. But we seem to be getting just pike. Hoping we can get through the pike and get a big perch. But it's all good fun. Like I say, it's uh, doing my achievements on the pike. Here we go again. <laughs> another grass, grass pickerel. So basically another small pike again. So as you can see, if you're struggling for a little pike, uh, this is an excellent spot. All around this bay area is very good for catching small pike. I've been doing my leveling up as well. I'm close to 15 now, so not too bad. Fishing for all the other species, uh, the trout as well. Spinning for those, that's been good fun. I think I do like the bass fishing overall the most. So it's going again. Is it going to go? No, it stopped. No, he's just playing with it. Sometimes you can tell uh, with the float when it's a pipe because you get a boil around the float. The water sort of like bubbles and you see like the ripples come off. As a perch. I've noticed a few times they just tend to slide away gradually. If you just want to catch numerous perch you can just use normal worms and you get them literally a fish a chuck just here. But as with any normal uh, trophy sized fish you have to put in a bit of time, a bit more effort. That's what makes it so rewarding when you get one. 
Well, something was nibbling at it a minute ago. Seems to have uh, gone away. In real life, you'd maybe give it a little twitch, reel it in a little bit, trying to entice a take. Does often work, that does. I don't know if they've actually done this in this game. I think what we'll do in a minute is, if we don't get anything here, we'll go over on the left near the bulrushes. I've had a few trophy perch there before, so we'll try it there. Floats just started going again, so fingers crossed. Here we go. And it's another small grass pike. Right, let's go over here to the uh, bulrushes, shall we? This is another good area. You do get a lot of small pike, as over near the lily pads, but you also get the perch. So, hopefully, we've caught all the small pike in the area. Come on, big perch, where are you hiding? Oh, got a little touch. What's this going to be? Here we go. <laughs> Another pickerel. So, we seem to be plagued by them. I knew we probably would, but it's good fun. Gives you XP. It's just a matter of time before you get a perch. The good thing about perch fishing is you can do it at a really low level and you don't really need any specialist gear apart from the minnows if you're going to live bait for them because of the gold. So as soon as you've got worms and a float set up, which is basically straight away, you can fish for them once you can come to New York. This is episode 6 in my series on Fishing Planet and I'll be doing loads of videos on it so if you want anything um, videoing or showing just drop a comment in the description and I'll see what I can do. Also if you want to do a Hunting Friends episode just PM me on Steam or add me and just say you're interested in doing one. If you've got a mic then you can join in with that also. Oh, we've got something biting here. Hopefully it's a trophy perch. Come on. Come on, take it. What is it? Sliding away. Come on. Yes. There's the trophy perch we've been after. Objective reached. I'm Ron McChew, playing Fishing Planet. Please subscribe to YouTube channels. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.